boy, oh boy, oh boy, it's arrived. Welcome back, flock, to another farming sim. 19 mods spotlight. This is where we check out some cool mods. I give you guys my thoughts and opinions, and I leave them linked down in the description down below, so you two can go download them if you if you want. Anyway, so uh, I don't usually do updates to mods that we've already covered, but I was excited for this one because the one thing I really, really wanted from the TLX, you know, this uh, generic truck that uh, that uh, one of the guys from Expendables is working on. Um, is I wanted the regular bed and the regular beds here. So uh, let's go ahead and let's, let's disconnect it. I guess let's do the truck first. See if if that allows us. to see if there's any difference. Uh, any, any differences in the truck? Cause it's an update. Uh, preset one. We're just going to build it ourselves in. Sport performance. Off road bead locks, bead locks two. We got off road winter. Did we have all that in the first one? I don't think so. We're gonna go with these. Actually, can we make them standard performance duels? Yeah, dualies. I want dualies. Yeah, all right, that works. Uh, front grill, I think it's just, just the same. Yep, um, sidestep steel. You know, yeah, sure. We'll go with it. Well, actually, I want I want steel. Uh, standard LED bar. Strobe light. Let's do strobe light. Yeah. Actually, can we do them all? I like those. I like those. Alright, kit standard front bumper design. Actually, I kind of like that look better. We're going with the tuned engine kits off road. Yeah, we already did that. Mirror standard towing. Let's do tow mirrors. Alright, customize. Yes. Let's just kind of kindly move this bad boy out of the way. Let's customize the bed. Toolbox. Yeah, we want a toolbox. Can we? Uh, I guess we can't do toolbox and side rails. Oh, but we can do headache rack and toolbox. I like that. Let's do that. Fenders. Yeah, we want dullies. Work light. <laughs> yes. Rear bumper main color. We did black on the other one, didn't we? Yeah, so let's do black on this one. And we didn't change the color at all, so I don't know what color that's supposed to be. Maybe it's like this. I hope that matches. It looks it looks right. Yes, I put a light bar on both the headache rack and the top of the truck because yellow. There we go. Oh, yes, that looks so good. Not even gonna lie, I dig it. I dig it a lot. Just make sure it hooks. The light bars are a bit overkill, but you know what? I don't even care at this point. I don't even care at this point. Alright. Alright, cool. So, awesome upgrade, or update, not upgrade, update to the uh, TLX pickup truck. This thing is freaking awesome. Uh, I highly recommend it. I highly recommend it if you just want, like, a generic truck. Uh, you don't. You don't want a name brand like Ford, Chevy, whatever. This is your truck. It's better than that other one that got put out uh, a while back. So, yeah. Five out of five. I don't even think I need to say it. Anyway. So, let's check out the stuff that we didn't get to last week before we spawn in the new stuff. So, we have the GMC Denali HD right here. I know as soon as 
as soon as someone sees what's sitting next to me, they're going to be like, where'd you get that? So the end of these episodes. Well, it might be. Depends on how quick we get through all this other stuff. Let's go to customize. Bed option standard. Toolbox. Headache rack, headache rack, and toolbox. Whoa, okay. Oh, I like it. Yeah, but we're gonna go with we're gonna go with the headache rack toolbox. Design, no equipment, fifth wheel, plow mount. Ooh, plow mount gets you a a light bar. Let's let's do that. And see if the light bar works. Uh, wheel setup standard, custom. Yeah, I like standard better. You know, they look kind of dopey. Design color, let's do. What'd that change? Ooh, ooh, no, 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 no. We're gonna go back to. Actually, I wanna go to chrome. Is there chrome? Yeah, chrome, main color. Ooh. I think we're gonna go, though, with a. Uh, so we have a. Iconic blue is always, always, always dope. Let's do it. We have all the lights. We have blinkers. We got strobes. We got a dinky little horn. Hooks until it goes down. Ooh, we can see what's underneath the hood. Nice. Oh, check out the strobes on the side. I'm really torn about this truck. I really like this truck, but I really don't like the rims on it. So I'll go ahead and give it, I'll give it a 5 out of 5. There's some things I don't like about it at all. Um, like the GMC logo lighting up. Unless I has, let, does that change by, let's go check that out real quick. I want to see if it changes with the color of the truck. Um, I just don't, I don't like the rims. If it wasn't for the rims, it, it, I, I, I would love this truck. That's my only thing I just I I can't get I like the I like the wheels on it. Like the, the tires, I just don't like the the actual dually rim. I I don't know why. Just I can't not see that going down the road. And the, the light and pattern for the light bars a bit. Yeah. But everything else is freaking great. I mean, the interior is amazing. Let's go ahead and let's uh customize it. Let's make it red, not red chrome. I don't want red chrome. Scarlet red. Customize. Yes. Does it? No, it doesn't change. I don't know if it's okay. Maybe it's white, just outlined in GMC instead of. I don't know. Yeah, but I'll give it a 5 out of 5. I, I just... The only thing I dislike is the uh, the rims on it. I would I would much rather have those those rims or something else on it. But it's a, it's a nice... It's a really nice looking truck. I, I don't have any complaints other than the rims. So let's move on to... Uh, let's 
do the dodge. The dooge. The dooge service trucks. Okay, so the only difference between these is this. I don't hear the Jake break on this one, so the Jake breaks on the other one. It's the only difference between the two, so we're not going to cover both of them because they're in the same pack. Just one has a Jake break, the other one doesn't. Customize, stock dually, fuel dually. See, those, I like those. Those aren't bad either, but those are Dodge rims. We're going to go with those. And shit's fast. Okay, yeah, we'll go with that one. That sounds like a Tyler move right there. Ooh, and plum crazy. Yep, you already know. Let's turn on our lights. We have all the lights. Do we have blinkers? We have blinkers. Do we have lights back here? We do. Reverse light. Oh yes, we have. We have the brightest of reverse lights. Horn. Another rinky dink horn. Isn't that the in-game one though? I'm not knocking that. For having the in-game horn, it, just, it sounds derpy. That all works. Nice interior. I guess it's better to have the Meet me horn over the train horns on everything. Do we have that tow? Yeah, it's still over here. Oh, wait, is this different? Hold on. Let's see if it's, it hooks just to the head. Maybe we don't need a tow hook for that one. That's what I'm curious about. Does this not work, maybe? Let's oh. Does that not work? Hold on, does that not work? The hitch is not giving us an option to pick up that tow hook. So let's go see if it works. Well, that works. I don't know how that works to be honest with you. So I'm not gonna I'm not gonna take off for the the 
the hook. I don't know how that works. Uh, it doesn't seem like it has... It's not like the other ones where you have to have the tow hook and it's a winch. Because it would... It, you would... See, I see the land, the land Rover is giving me the winch option, not the actual service truck. But we'll go to the service truck overall, 5 out of 5. It does look good. The lights and everything work. I'm not so sure of the crane. I have the most terrible luck with cranes uh, or, or winches and any of that in this game. So I'm not going to take off for it. It does look good, at, you know, overall. The only thing I really wish at the we've seen in the other service trucks that we're not seeing in this one is the refuel trigger uh, i would love to have it so because that that's the only reason why i chose the ford uh from last week to put in the server over this thing because it doesn't have that refuel trigger so i would love to have that out option on this thing um and and it would be it, it would be in the server but uh, it doesn't so that's kind of a bummer but overall five out of five what you see is what you get go ahead and shut it off all right so let's do... Now that is a scaling difference right there, I'm telling you. Was it supposed to be that? I, I highly doubt it's supposed to be that that difference in size, but... You never know. Customize. Alright, we have... I don't know what that actually changed. Oh, the rims? Can you change the rim color? Okay. Oh, look at all these options. Purple metallic. You are ready to know. Um, is there like a... No, I don't want that. The uh, What is that color? Well, iconic blue. Let's go with it. I was looking for... Um, Nitro blue, there we go. That's the one I want. Design color. Red? I don't know what that changes. Alright. Light bar, bull bar. Half bull bar, none. I guess let's go bull bar design. Snorkel. Snorkel one. LED bar. Where's the LED bar? Oh, down there. Okay. LED bar two. Fog lights. No, body rack. Yeah, just give me everything. Yep, step stock. Side steps. I want the side steps. Freestyle alloys. Boost alloys. Steel. Yep, that's what I want right there. Wagon wheels. Yes. Rock me, mama, like a wagon wheel. Rock me, mama, anyway, feel. Hey, mama, rock me. Tuned, yep. Alright, here we go. Here's our grocery getter. We have lights, we have blinkers, we have reverse lights, that works, it's interior, whoa, okay, up is down, down is up, but left and right are right. Wait, hey, I'm outside. Hello, okay. What? I, uh, I hate when controls are reversed. Alright. There it is. All right.
There we go. Come on, you big son of a gun. Yeah, it works. Alright. Go ahead and disconnect that. Alright, turn off winch sun visors. There we go. Oh, I, I can't see. I saw them in there. Alright. Alright. I think I've, I've seen enough. A, uh, the camera. I hate the camera. Uh, it's, it's a personal preference. Uh, so up is down, and down is up. Right is right, left is left. It's it's a bit weird and wonky to get to. Uh, if you're gonna do reverse for up and down, you could do reverse for left and right, and make it a whole heck of a lot less confusing. Um, or just stick with the the uh, up is up and down is down. <laughs> Uh, but it looks great on the inside. It looks great on the outside. Uh, I would love if you choose the option to have the gas tanks that you could you could store fuel in there. That'd be awesome. Um, so you, that way, if you run out of gas or you uh, want to use it as like a little service truck, that's an option. Um, but other than that, I, I really don't have any complaints. It's it's a nice looking little truck or SUV, and everything works. So five out of five. So now let's go over to the other one that's uh, either underscaled or, or that one's overscaled. I don't know. I would imagine they'd be the same size, but I could be wrong. Feel free to let me know. I don't much know much about Land Rovers. Oh, this one we're driving on the other side there, eh? I don't know why it's the Canadian, or to the Canadian accent, because they drive on the same side of the road as us. It looks good in here, though. This is going to get some... They can get used to. What's that do? I don't see where it changes anything. All right. Customize. Oh, that pink though. Can we do that pink? Where's pink? Oh yeah. All right. Bull bar. So this has got like b the same options. Pretty dope. You got a little place to sit up there. <laughs> Freestyle alloys, boost alloys, steel wheels, wagon wheels. Rock me, mama, like a wagon wheel. Rock me, mama, any but what? I don't hate it. <laughs> Outer rim. I don't know what the changes. Alright, customize. Yes. We have reverse lights. We have blinkers. We have brake lights. We have lights. The blinkers in front, we do. I don't think this one has a winch. No, it doesn't have the winch. All right. So my main concern with this is 
again, feel free to let me know in the comment section down below if this one's supposed to be smaller than that one. If so, okay. Uh, if not, I mean, that's a huge difference. And they look, that, I mean, the front ends look the same. That's supposed to be a 110. It just says Land Rover. So I feel like, I feel like one of them's overscaled and one of them's underscaled. Because that's a huge difference. But again, I know nothing about Land Rover. So, I mean, this could be like a, a more uh, expensive model. Bigger or something. Like, kind of like the, this could be like the Ford Ranger. And this could be like the F350. I don't know. Um, like I said, I have no clue about Land Rovers, but that, I mean, if they're supposed to be the same, that's a huge difference, so. Let me know in the comment section down below. I'm going to give them both 5 out of 5s, because, I mean, they do look great. This, the, the scale is really concerning. I think we have enough time for one more, so let's get to the last one we have from last week. And that's this Ferd here. This Ferd F250, I think. 350. Oh. It's like it's limping. Customize. Alright. Design, no tools, service tools. <sighs> Got the same problem that, uh. What was it that we were using? It's got the same two toolboxes. I, w I kind of would rather have a b better tool, like an actual toolbox instead of that. Um, wheel setup. Custom mud. This roll nose. Mud cramplers. Uh, I guess we're going to have to go with that. Main color. Red. Design color. Red. At least we can make them black. They don't look as, they don't look so bad in black. I, okay, I'm I think it's growing on me because I that really doesn't look as bad in black than as the other ones or the some of the other ones I've seen. So let's go ahead and do that. Tailgate falls down as it does. Hooks. That hooks. Hold that up. All of our lights work, our blinkers work. All right. Two quick looks. See in the interior. I uh, I like it. I like it actually a lot. Actually, um, I think well, one. The only thing I I don't like is that the one option for wheels don't work. Don't know what happened there. Uh, but other than that, I do like it. I kind of wish they had an an actual like uh, your your typical toolbox I know why they did this is because you uh, this is the toolbox that a lot of people have used that has the what okay that has the service tools to it oh it's the tailgate there all right um, 
but other than that, I don't there's I don't really have any complaints other than the wheels and the toolbox. Uh, the toolbox is all right. It's fine. Um, I just kind of wish it had a, a typical toolbox instead of that. Um, I can't really think of anything other than like uh, if you don't have the toolbox, I would love the like stacks on it. That'd be awesome. Um, but I really don't have anything else to, to say. Like, I, I mean, it's fine just the way it is. Uh, so we'll go ahead and give it a 5 out of 5. And that will do it for today's video, guys. Don't worry about the other mods. The mods, uh, the other three mods you see sitting there will be covered in next week's Mod Spotlight. If you guys did like this week's Mod Spotlight, be sure to leave a like down below. It does help me out so very, very much, and I do appreciate it so very, very much. If you guys do want to see future live streams, be sure to click that subscribe button. If you guys want to be notified whenever I do go live or upload a video, be sure to click that notification bell. As always, guys, thank you so very, very much for watching, and I will see you guys next week. Bye!